Hi everyone. Today I'll be discussing about math paper one, question seven. Math paper one is non-calculator. That means you can't use calculator. That's cheating. Well, you can, at least you can use your brain or a piece of paper. All right, let's get into it. All right, question seven. The diagram shows a square with perimeter of the museum. Eight of these squares fit together to make a rectangle. A, calculate the area of a square, and B, calculate the area of a rectangle. All right. You know these numbers, they're obviously wrong. All right. The diagram shows a square with a perimeter of 20 cm. And we have keywords here. Keyword one, we have perimeter and 20 cm. Make sure you see the perimeter here. You don't want to make that mistake, all right? So this square has a perimeter of 20 cm, all right? And for A, we need to calculate the area. So, are they going to give us the area? So, we go to work with what we have here. All right, we see a square, okay? He also mentions it's a square. You can make sure it's a square. And most importantly, not to scale. Can't measure it with your ruler. So, a square with a perimeter of 20 cm. How do we find it? All right, perimeter equals two. The way that people calculate the perimeter is when they have, they add up all sides to this square. Yeah. It's a perimeter to square. But don't worry, because they say it's a square, it looks like a square. So a square has four equal sides. That means all four sides of the square is equal. So we just gotta find the length of each square, because the way they calculate the area equals to the length times width. And length and width doesn't really matter for square because they're all the same. All right, so we find it 20 cm. Divide by four equals to five cm. All right, now you have the area. Length times width, 5 cm times 5 cm. They're the same thing because it's a square. Equals to 25 cm. All right, we have it for the first one. Answer is 25. Don't need to put the cm2, don't need to put the unit because it's already here. All right, so we move on to the B part. Calculate the area of the rectangle. All right, to make it clear, the rectangles over here. And again, not to scale. That means it means you still can't measure it with a ruler. Well, there's always a way to calculate it. Okay, let's see. All right. Keywords here. Eight of these squares fit together to make a true rectangle. Yeah. Here states the rectangle. All right. Eight of these squares, which is this one over here, we calculated just now, fit together to make a rectangle. All right. So eight of these squares one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight is one rectangle. So, to make it easier, we can just take the 25 cm2, multiply it by eight, equals to 200 cm square. All right. For the answer, 
just need to write 200. No need the unit, it's already here. You don't want to make that mistake. So thank you. Bye.